Why Rachel? I don't have time to tell you everything. But she was special. A human chameleon, so many visual possibilities. We had a real connection. Uh, she let you take pictures? Did you know Frank? Did she let you take pictures? Did she let you take pictures of her? Rachel was in love with me. That's not my ego. Just look at our sessions. Not that I'll let you. Nobody loved having their picture taken more. Anyway, Rachel is dead. But no tears. Los Angeles would have killed her anyway. So look at this as a favor. You're evil. Oh, I see. You're good because you stopped your friend from beating Nathan up. I cared more about Nathan than you did. No, you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic what I do with the camera and subject, like father, but not like son. Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. Do you finally get it now, Max? I can't compromise my vision with amateurs. You are an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. You can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't care what you do to me. You're gonna die, motherfucker. For Chloe and Rachel and everybody else. I do love your spirit, Max, but you brought yourself here by your own choice. Anyway, I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. Okay. Now, let's see how these shots came out. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your work out. Alone with a heart, a um, okay, so now I'm here. Sorry, this is not art. Journal. I have all those photos in my diary. This could be a way out. I have all the photos in my diary. I have to talk to him again. Max, I wish you could see yourself now. I have to wait. I looked at my journal and I have to talk to him again. Really? Oh man. Okay. Wait. Please, Mr. Jefferson. Max, I would love to talk shop, but I really need to go over these pictures. Especially while they're fresh in my mind. I think our session was a career high for me. Um, let me go show me the photos. What are you going to do with my diary? Really? You, you still have my diary. Don't worry. Nobody's going to read it. Thanks for reminding me. There's nothing more innocent than a teenager's diary. Oh, look at your selfies. What a waste of talent. Look at that shot, Max. You can do so much better. Okay, so apparently we could talk to him about other things. I suppose we don't want to. Well, he gave us a photo. We're going further back in time. Where are we going back to? I knew it. I knew it. We're just gonna go back in time. See, I knew it! Oh, Chloe's dead! What, what are we gonna do now? Chloe's dead! You just turn back time and then nothing's wrong. <laughs> of course! So this, uh, I knew it. And all these cliffhangers, look, every time they have this ridiculous thing happen at a cliffhanger, at the end of an episode, you just rewind back time half an hour later, and then it, it's, so, it's you might, as well, might as well never happened. It's like these parts of the story, are, they don't fit into the actual story, they're just kind of things that happen. I mean, I guess they, they, they fit in a little bit, but the fact that you rewind them every single time means that they're not... <laughs> It's like, they're not even important, right? They're not, they're not that important. I knew it, of course. The last time we did this, this time we did the same thing. And then we just go back in time. B 
before it happens. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb I'm back. A wonderful photographic right back where I started this insane week. And nobody course, is going to hurt Chloe know, ever again. The portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Um, a real visionary not capturing. Who cares? The Gerion process not capturing. A real visionary? What do I want to do about this? I don't know. The Daguerrean process. He was a real visionary. Not a hypocrite. Uh... <laughs> what do you mean by that? I mean that he actually created something. He didn't just take pictures of models and pretend they were art. I'm not sure I get the connection, but... Uh... Yes, the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular. Mainly because it gave the subjects clear, defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max has clearly read more into them than I have. Right. And hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday time Heroes. Time to change time. The winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the First, Arts let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. And Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Bastard. Okay. I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. Warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. Let's look at the bag. I've got a ton of Blackwell brochures, so I hope David's number is in there. Uh, search. I should be able to track down David's number from the school pamphlet. Blackwell Academy 1910. For over a hundred years, Blackwell Academy has been an academic oasis for art and science with diverse students from around the world seeking to change the world and their communities. Seeking to change the world and their communities. Isn't that redundant? If you change the world, doesn't that mean you've already changed your community as well? Um, meet your professors, Mark Jefferson... After blazing a trail in the world of 1990s style and fashion photography, Mark Jefferson always knew he wanted to share his vision and inspire others. In the late 2000s, he took a well-publicized detour into teaching around the country, inevitably ending up in a permanent position at Blackwell Academy. Mr. Jefferson's classes on art and photography are some of the most popular in the school's rich history, and his students will certainly go on to inspire others with their own vision. Found sure. you. Uh, security, David Madsen, although we can talk to other people too, Samuel Taylor, Mariana Taylor, Lisa Avena, 555-630-8243, I don't have to memorize that, do I? Uh, there's that, look at journal. This diary literally saved my life. Uh, look at... I hope I still love photography when this is done. Sure you will. Don't confuse the art with the artist. <laughs> Bastard. Did you know someday your pictures would actually alter time and space? Did you let me just enjoy this moment a little bit longer? Wait, can't we oh we can't talk to Kate? We want David. For once, David, I'm praying you'll overreact to this as much as everything else. And take Jefferson down fast. Uh, Mr. Manson, you are after Rachel Amber. Mark Jefferson is guilty. His dark room is under the Prescott's farmhouse. You know the location. He's sick and dangerous. Stop him. You wanted me to enter the contest, asshole. So maybe I'll be going to San Francisco. And Jefferson, you'll be going to prison. It's the past within the past. Am I pushing myself too hard? 
You're pushing yourself. It doesn't matter what happens to me. I have to save Chloe. As much as is necessary. If only I could tell the whole class about Jefferson and watch him squirm. But I better let David take care of everything. All right, that's the plan. Not impressed anymore. Well, it's a tripod. Now I wonder how many victims Jefferson has left behind in his career. Can't be that many. I mean, I mean, you kill one person, might get away with it. Kill two or three people, maybe get away with it. How many dozens of people can you actually kill and still get away with it? It's not that easy, right? The 90s are over for you, asshole. Ah, uh, da, da 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 Hi, Kate. Poor Kate. Hi, Kate. Oh. Hey, Max. Kate, listen to me. I am. Always remember that you're not alone. I've got your back no matter what happens. So do a lot of other people. We all care. We're all here for you. You need to know that. Max, that makes me feel so blessed for the first time this week. I, I don't know what to say. That's okay. Neither do I. Maybe we could both use a hug. Yeah, yeah, this. This is what you should have done at the very Thanks. beginning. You always know the right thing to do. I knew the right thing to do at the start of the game. That's what you should have done at the start of the game. The game doesn't let you though. Because if the game let you do that, then you wouldn't have to uh, go to the roof and do the dramatic thing. There's no drama if you do everything right. You see what I mean? If you do everything right, there's no drama in your life. And your life is just unremarkable. At least Kate knows people have her back. Indeed. This is the last time somebody bullies you, Kate. Dear Kate, we love your porn video, XOXO Black Oak Academy. Uh, it's marks. Oh, Rachel. I'm sorry. Rachel Amber, love forever. Notebook? Victoria. It's nice to know how you really feel. My phone is dead and I'm bored. Time to bust out my posy. Why did I give up the word for the image? Because I suck, but Mark Jefferson rules. Everyone in here loves him, but he only seems to care about Maxie. I want to hate her, but I, she wouldn't care. Envy is a sin, Vic. Get over yourself. Ah, uh, okay. Alright, Victoria. I'm happy it's... to fix it, so you'll be here to get your fancy camera, Victoria. Okay, well, this is a camera thing. Photo equipment. I can't blame the cameras, but I just think of Jefferson using them. i uh, sure you do. All right, books. Just a week ago, I was so naive about art, life, the world. You're still naive. We still haven't talked about your privilege, Max. The fact that you spend so much money on film. While, you know, we never gave any money to that homeless woman. By the diner, and we never gave any money to Chloe's family since they're kind of almost bankrupt. But you keep spending money on your film, Max. So we never talked about that yet. I can't go past these photo boundaries, so I need to fix everything from here. An everyday hero is going to bust your ass, Jefferson. Yes. There's still some beauty left in Arcadia Bay. There's a lot of beauty left in Arcadia Bay. Don't let one person mess up your whole perspective on life. I still feel like the lighthouse is calling out to me. You know, there's something quite phallic about the shape of the lighthouse, right? I'm sorry to bring penises into this, but that, that's the shape of it, right? I'd like to bust this up right now. Um, 
Let's see what's going on. So there's only Victoria. Victoria, I'm sorry you have to stand next to that psycho. And then there's Jefferson. I see right through your bullshit, Jefferson. Everybody else will too. All right, give photo. Mr. Jefferson, we need to talk. Uh. Can you see I'm talking to Mr. Jefferson now? Yes, I see. But maybe you shouldn't. Uh, and why not? Hold on, Victoria. Are you okay, Max? I will be when Victoria understands that hiding behind a screen, posting videos of people is incredibly cruel and unfair. You're smart enough to know how easy it is to hurt somebody, to destroy their life. I just want you to think about how much it would hurt if somebody did that to you. You can always make the right choice, Victoria. I know you've got a good heart. I've seen it. Listen, I... I didn't... You don't have to explain. There's no reason for you to be so insecure that you can't be happy with your own talent. Wouldn't it be better to lift people up than to bring them down? You could inspire people. Okay, I don't know what you're talking about now, do I, Mr. Jefferson? I think I should stay out of this one, Victoria. Then I guess I'm done talking. And that's okay, too. All right, bye. That's a bit much, but that okay. Was kind of random, Max. What did you mean? Here's my photograph for the Everyday Heroes contest. Oh, uh, that was easy. No, it wasn't easy at all. Well, I, uh, I, I can't prejudge yet, but I'm very happy you decided to enter. That means a lot to me. And Blackwell. The, the first step for any artist is to put themselves out there in the world without fear. To be innocent. Or guilty. Uh, well, thanks for the photo, and maybe both of us will be jet-setting to San Francisco this Friday. Or maybe only one of us will be going. Don't be so modest, Max. Anything can happen in a week. As you're going to find out, Mr. Jefferson. That's a bit much. <laughs> That's a little bit too much, Venom. I mean, when you've already won, you don't need to be that angry anymore. But okay. <laughs> Stop walking on train tracks. It's not a. It's not a toy. A train track is not. It's not games. All right. There's trains. Oh, right. Does that really fix everything? Well, Rachel Amber's still dead. Maybe we can find one of Rachel's photos and go all the way back. And Chloe's not dead, yay! Yay, Chloe's not dead, happy ending. This game. Wait, where are we going now? We're we going to San Francisco? Is that where we're going? Whoa! We are. Oh, we're in a plane. Pack Pacific? I mean, Pack West? Pacific okay. West? Pack You're West? Okay, Max. You're safe. I'm on a plane. Are you? Why are you here? I hope I did everything right this time. Uh, did you? Maybe you did, maybe you didn't. The independent local teacher... Good work, David. Okay. A lot of stuff changed. And we don't know what. What am I wearing on my... Hold on. Uh, holy shit, you rule, Max. I'm Chloe. so proud of my... Superstar. This is just the start of your career. Am I wearing Rachel Amber's I earring? I fixed everything. No, you didn't. Well, sir. The game's not over. You're wearing Rachel Amber's earring around your neck. What am I wearing? That is. 
That is her. Be careful. I'm still between realities. And I can't focus on this one for too long. Why? Why? Why are we between realities? Where are we? I don't know what's going on. Let's look. It's so weird to be in between realities. Pack West Airlines. Everything is out of focus and in the distance. Yeah, but why? What's going on? I can't wait to the beginning of the end for Jefferson and the Prescotts. Read. Two Moon Diner. Amid all the environmental chaos in Arcadia Bay, such as the unusual snowfall and beast whales, some residents reported seeing two full moons last night around 8 p.m. Witnesses claimed double moons were clear in the night sky until clouds covered them up shortly after they, they disappeared. No cell phone or video footage has surfaced yet, which has led local meteorologists to believe that imaginations are in overdrive due to the recent eco-havoc. Blackwell Security uncovered bunker and scandal. Acting on a series of tips from David Madsen, head of security at Blackwell Academy, police officers descended Tuesday on a bizarre in on a bizarre underground chamber allegedly used by teacher Mark Jefferson and student Nathan Prescott to drug, kidnap, and photograph young women. <laughs> Apparently used by teacher Mark Jefferson and student Nathan Prescott to drug, kidnap, and photograph young women. See, that's not how things usually happen. Usually it's drug kidnap, rape, and kill young women. Drug, kidnap, and photograph young women? <laughs> oh, this, okay. I mean, is the rape just implied? Or is it, I don't know. Did they just don't want to deal with it in the game? I don't know. <laughs> A photograph? That's not how look. That's not how things usually happen. All right, it's not. They don't just take photos. They do a lot of other things. To a young women can kidnap. Pretty terrible things. All right, let's continue. Although there were no other signs of physical or sexual assault on the victims, the disturbing revelations have sent shockwaves through the tr tranquil city of Arcadia Bay. Even Sean Prescott, the most powerful businessman in the area, is under investigation for his role as owner of the farmhouse where the high-tech darkroom studio was located. No other signs of physical or sexual assault on the victims. Okay, but there were corpses. There was murder as well, they found Rachel Amber's corpse. 